Hello pretties, so happy Eve of Christmas Eve. I think I'm gonna get this video up probably on the 23rd. Uh, I don't want to wait any longer than that, um, but I did some last minute gift and stocking stuffer shopping at the Dollar Tree today. Um, well, actually it was yesterday, depending on when I get this uploaded. Um, I'm doing the intro, I just got back. I'm doing the intro of the day I went and got this stuff, so. I don't know if that makes sense. I'm rambling. Do you see how cray cray I feel now? Because it's just like a madhouse out there. Dollar Tree's perfect for last minute stuff and they have a ton of stuff still at my store. Found all kinds of really cool stuff. So first and foremost, I grabbed a pack of batteries and I do keep batteries with me on Christmas because I find that somewhere, whichever houses or places we're going, someone's gonna need them. I've already opened them myself. <laughs> I got lucky finding another one of these mailboxes and one of my subscribers, I believe it was Connie Marie, I think that was who it was, so she gave me the idea of giving this to my postal worker. So I'm going to fill this with some goodies for her. It's just perfect. So I was going to put it in a basket um, or a bag, but now I have this and I just think this is so cute and I was so happy I found it. I could not believe it. A box of the Palmer peppermint bark. This stuff is seriously delicious, um, but this is for my husband. This is part of a little um, Christmas Eve type thing I'm doing. Christmas, or Christmas Eve surprise box, something like that. Anyway, these are going to be in there. If you guys want to see how I put that together, I, let me know in the comments. I don't know how exciting it'll be. There's probably a million videos already about that. I get this pack of pencils and two erasers and this is the elf on the shelf stationary set and i'm not really sure who this is going to if it's going in our little christmas eve box because todd loves like old school pencils he did some gift tags and oh the selection you guys was seriously next to nothing but i ended up getting these and there's 18 little graphics on here kind of pop up and they're kind of like 3d or whatever they're really cute. I grabbed one of these treat jars. I have a friend that I met at the dog park actually. I make homemade treats for Wrigley a lot and so I thought that I would put some of the batch I just made him in here and tie a ribbon around it and I actually also got both of their dogs some toys as well. That was one of those last minute you know people that I wanted to give a gift to. So I have a 13 year old that I'm buying for that I did a theme gift for her Betsy Johnson makeup bag and I'm just filling it with all kinds of makeup and stuff and brushes. I found this brush, it's a smudge brush by e.l.f. I have her tons of e.l.f. brushes in there. Um, she's really only allowed to wear neutral colors so I scooped these up because these are two of my own holy grails and this is the Wet n Wild um, color icon in sugar and then this one is in creme brulee and then also just for funsies um, if she you know was allowed to wear that around the house I know she'll love that so anyway I also found this elf jumbo eye stick and this one is in the shade little miss thing and I just thought that was perfect grabbed her a pack of these little lip glosses green apple lemon drop found her a little baby watermelon rainbow <laughs> there was only one floating around this was a complete score. I found this Rituki card game. This is a stocking stuffer for my uncle. He loves card games, so I scooped that up. It is going to be a gift all by itself. Uh, this is a, what are these called? Oh, fragrance diffusers. Gosh, you guys, my brain's fried. This is going to be a gift for my neighbor. I'm just going to wrap it up, put a bow on it. It looks like super nice quality, seriously. And by the way, do you guys love my gloriously cheesy Christmas blanket? Clashes everything. It's fabulous, right? So these are meant for stocking stuffers for one person and I have to tell you guys, I have one of these myself. I've tested it out. These work. I got this USB charger. It's an emergency charger. I have that because that's an amazing, amazing product right there for a buck. This is an iPhone 4 case and it's by tech so it's fancy. So they had these still floating around. Um, I found this like at the bottom bin, random stuff in the electronics section, and this particular little one, she's got it off them for what she inherited, but she doesn't know she's getting a new iPad, and that's what I got this for. I got her one of those iPad cases. I thought, you know, I'd get her something for her phone as well, because she was less than thrilled about getting the iPhone 4, but she's going to be like 
blown away when she gets that iPad. So I got invited to a secret Santa party and I found this um, jewelry organizer. I got the black one and I know these have been all over <laughs> YouTube and uh, probably Instagram I'm sure but I saw the black and the white and I like the black one. I found another one of these jewelry polishing cloths and I loved mine so much that I grabbed this to put with it and I also have a really cute charm bracelet. I didn't know whether to gift just the bracelet by itself but when I went to Dollar Tree and I saw these things I thought oh perfect addition. These two things are going to be stocking stuffers. I actually just recently reviewed this and gave it this one a terrible review um, but that's not to say that someone else won't like it and I wanted to get it with this one because I, I personally have used this, the uh, Gentleman's Fine Grooming Shaving, whatever, yeah, shaving cream, and this is the shaving balm, and I love the shaving cream, I actually stole it from my husband, I had already had this, but I saw a bottle of this, so if anything, it was just a dollar, and that way they have both products, um, I'm not sure if there's more than two with these. These three products I am putting into a spa or, you know, kind of relaxation gift basket I'm making for someone. I found one of these Sensual Vanilla Intimate Secrets Body Spray. I grabbed this charcoal face mask. This is one of my favorite products at Dollar Tree. They had some of these. And also these Global Beauty Care Retinol Cleansing Cloths. These little Milani Intense Liquid Lip Colors. I actually am not sure who these are going to, but these are going to be stocking stuffers. These are stocking stuffers. I found a Billy Blanks Tabo Celebrity Fit Cardio, and I thought this was so funny because they had some of the body wipes for sports. I freaking love these. These are amazing, so I thought that'd be kind of like a nice little thing wrap it up together with that because Tabo makes you sweat, people. It's fun, and it makes you sweat. The person that's getting it, he totally makes fun of me. It's like one of my friend's husbands. He makes fun of me. All the time because I'm like always obsessed with white products so he's gonna get some of his own and he's probably gonna like them so these products here are all for my manicure in a jar gift I'm gonna give to my neighbor and she will love this she works with animals she works at a shelter she rarely gets to have time to like pamper herself who loves nail polish and she loves to do her nails so I grabbed her some Essie strips the um, amazing cuticle oil I love this stuff. I grabbed her one of the Nivea creams and three color crazes. This one is called Craze. When my, it's called Timeless. It is the perfect neutral color, like a pink color. And then I got her one of the Rapid Dry Top Coats. I did a video on that, what was it, two years ago? Or gosh, I don't know, you guys. It was a long time ago. I did a video about my little manicure in a jar. I also have a little baby bottle of nail polish remover that I got from Walmart for 97 cents. And then I'm just going to add some cotton balls and a nail file, which I already had purchased. And that's going to be her little manicure in a jar. So I scored in the stationary aisle. Seems like I always do. I found this craft glue. It's scented and it's got blueberry and strawberry and there's a little one that we I, I'm putting like a themed gift together for she loves like stickers and gluing stuff and doing little crafts like with foam pieces and shapes and all that and I found this and I was like you know what that is so much cooler than the glue I had already purchased for her so. and then I also found these these are brand spanking new these notebooks these are actually like knockoffs of an MR8 notebook that I am obsessed with myself that I used to could only find at Target and they're like $9 notebooks and these are almost dead ringers for them. And I also grabbed a really pretty pearly pen. They still had these. This is a stocking stuffer for one that's getting the makeup. She's into journaling and writing things down now. I scored huge on this book. This is 201 Organic Smoothies and Juices for a healthy pregnancy. This is not for me, <laughs> for um, someone who is expecting and she is getting into clean eating and she's also getting a really, really nice blender for Christmas and a little birdie told me that. So I saw this and I was like, oh my goodness gracious, I have to get her this. We have her a really nice set of measuring cups and also a set of glasses. And when I saw these glasses on this book, I was just like, you know, like Eureka, this is just perfect. Just something like a little add on. Hello, Wrigley. Hi, sweetie. That retails for $20, not $19.99. So that was a complete steal. 
This book also, um, this is an add-on gift uh, for another neighbor. I got her some of her favorite gourmet chocolate. I want something to go with it, but I didn't know what to get. She's retired, she loves to read, and I saw this. It's a memoir about a girl who grew up in like a restaurant type bakery thing. She loves to read, she'll probably read this in one day. Um, this one retails for, or retailed for Geez, $25.95. I thought that was a really nice little touch to that. So that's it for my last minute Christmas gifts slash stocking stuffers slash things haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And maybe it even gave you some ideas of things like you could put together really quickly if you are in a time crunch. Todd and I always end up in a time crunch. And there are so many people I always want to buy for. I, you know, things like this. Like I was looking for something for my neighbor. But then I saw other things too and other treasures like these to go with gifts I already had. I'd love to know when did you finish your Christmas shopping? Some of my friends had theirs done in November. November. And I'm sitting over here like, really? Let me know what your status is on gifts. Are you done shopping? Do you just have to wrap things? Uh, let me some comments down below. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.